A very good morning to you all, ladies and gentlemen. I hope that you're all good, and you can hear the game is on. Today is the beginning of the solstice event, the summer and winter solstice switchover. I think I'm going to struggle like I did last week to make videos. So far, I'm looking at the spawns. They're a bit rubbish. Chimchar back in the wild, which is honestly one of the last things I want to see. I hate Chimchar with a passion. The good news is that Reggie Gigas is now in the level 5 raids with a shiny. First time shiny Reggie Gigas has been made available in the Pokemon Go. 100% CPs you're looking for, I believe, are 2483 for the level 20 and then 3104 for the level 25 weather booster. And it's boosted in partly cloudy weather because it's a pure normal type Pokemon. It is one hell of a tanky son of a I would recommend getting at least like five to six people to do this properly, particularly if on the lower level scale of things. You can trio this, but with severe difficulty and hopefully no Giga Impact. It learns Giga Impact as its move, and honestly, if that's if that's weather boosted, it's a one-shot KO no matter what your Pokemon is. I've got a couple of things I need to do in the house. Hopefully keep my eye out for some raid invites, and we'll see what happens, shall we? This might be a very short, sharp little video, but um, apparently Yanma in the Northern Hemisphere is a boosted shiny for this uh, event which why I don't I personally don't need it but good luck if you do need it we may pop out later I've got to wait for a delivery so we'll see how things pan out this afternoon shall we I've actually got a Reggie Gigas check for you ladies and gentlemen and 2447 obviously 2483 would be the Honda but thank you very much Shelby for that invite and I said it on the live stream yesterday the, honestly the most recent update for the game is a disaster it is a complete bloody disaster. You can no longer click through the rape awards. There is there's a warning apparently that when you encounter a certain Pokemon on certain devices, it can cause such a bright flash that it can actually trigger photosensitivity issues. So if you have if you have epilepsy or anything like that, please be bloody aware that this most recent update could be problematic to say the least. So just take care. If you have or turn off auto update. For God's sake, this is why auto-update should not be enabled. I thought I had it turned off, but apparently my iPhone decided to turn the bloody setting back on. Anyway, purple shiny, please? No. Let's do this sensibly, shall we? So we're actually going to kind of demonstrate. This Regigiga circle is extremely easy to hit. You're just going to time it with the attack. The excellent is also enormous. Christ, we haven't... I don't think we've... We haven't had this in raids since February, early March 2020 since the EX raids, and that was the first ball catch with 4XL candy. I was rather hoping to try and show you a little bit more of a struggle, but there we go, 87% from Australia. Literally, Niantic seems to be pushing mega slow bro at me. Reggie Gigas raid check. Oh, low power mode, not, not fantastic. 2461, I think I saw. Thanks, Francesco, for the raid invite. I can't tick through, I'm actually in the middle of doing some ironing. Come on, give me that shiny. Third raid, that would be brilliant. Fingers crossed. No. Damn. Oh my god, 24, 34. Awful. This is great if you find an excellent throw task, I have to say. One excellent. There we go, and throw. You can probably throw a bit earlier than that, to be honest. When its hand has only just gone to the front of the screen, you could probably throw the ball then. And down. Second ball. We can finally see what it maxes out as. So this is my 98%, which I actually think I got way back in the early days of the channel, but 4,902 is a 98% max to level 50, so it'll be slightly higher for a hundo, but that is insane. Another Reggie Gigas check, thank you very much, Tom, for the raid invite. 2424. Ouch, that is horrific. 13 golden rats, though. We're going to get no rare candy. Oh, six rare candy, okay. I tell a lie, but you lose so much time having to watch the rewards. We'd already have shiny checked it. Come on. Yes. <laughs> yes. Four raids. Four raids for that shiny. Yes. <laughs> Look, that is such a nice shiny, isn't it? It's purple. It looks sensational. That's beautiful. We're going to catch it very, very quickly. Oh, brilliant. Day one. Boom. Shiny. Sorted. Let me know in the comments if you've managed to bag yourself a shiny Regicigus already. That's fantastic. Yes. 
is absolutely horrific stats, but that's not the point. That is a sensational shiny. That is awesome. Thank you to Alison Becker for this invite. 2457, it's higher than we had, but still not really good enough. Also, the best thing, my iron's just broke. But, not a back to back shiny, that would have been too mad. I'm not even going to wait to set an excellent. Let's just throw, an, throw a great in and instant breakout. Okay, we're going to have to set the circle then. Giga Impact literally rips through absolutely anything and everything. And Niantic's recommended wants to always throw a Metagross in because of its resistances, but you need, because it's so tanky, you have to be doing super effective damage against Regigigas in the raid boss. Otherwise, it's just going to take too long. And then you won't get enough balls to catch it properly. But there we go. Caught, done and dusted. 4XL. This one is pretty terrible. But again, a distance tray, which is very nice to see. No level 5s around me. This has been a trend recently. All of this month, serious lack of raids. Which is really quite irritating. Ooh, there we go. That's another raid done. Thank you very much, Gabriella, for that invite. Okay, well that is a terrible one, but it was weather boosted. <laughs> 3033 we saw. Weather boosted, as I said earlier, was 3104. Oh god, just... It's so slow! No shine number two, but that's okay. I imagine this one's going to be an absolute feisty... Yep, there we go, feisty... Feisty one. And it reset the circle on me! Are you re... What? Ah, oh, this game. At least excellent is easy enough to hit. It, it feels very laggy. It feels like there's dropped frames. Apparently there's a patch going out for iOS for the update. It's dropping frames. It's really odd. Like you sort of jump. It jumps forward in animations and things you do in the game. It's extremely disorientating. Right, we're going to go for our nanab trait because this thing is just being ridiculous. Terrible throw, instant breakout. Boom, Golden Rust Curve excellent immediately afterwards. The Pokeball's flipping, staying open, and I'm not getting more than one roll on this. This is ridiculous. Because it's a high CP, bad IV. You saw it, it, it lagged then. Can I get more than one roll on this? Are you for real? Just like, yeah, see, it's lagging there. There we go. Caught it, but it sort of like jumps forward in the animation. It's extremely laggy. I know I've said that about six times in this clip, but there we go, from Sweden. Very nice, thank you so much for the invite. And another raid invite, here we go. Thanks very much, Tom. Let's see if we can get another shiny Reggie Gigas. Come on, I need to restart my game as well. It's been bug buggy as hell. Let's see how long that took. Jesus Christ, 2389. That could very well be the worst one you can get. Because <laughs> 2483 is the hundo. Attack. See, the attack animation that started about halfway through, it just suddenly was like, boom, I'm halfway through my animation. Niantic, I hope to God that you're patching this, because this is the some of the buggiest and laggiest shit I've ever seen. One month away from GoFest, and the GoFest, yep, 67%. Beautiful. Shame it couldn't have been shiny. We're a month away from GoFest, and it is this buggy and laggy and stuff. GoFest is going to have the most people playing on the server at one time. So, fix the game Niantic, and turn off GBL. Turn off Go Battle League during GoFest weekend, for God's sake. Goodness me. Right, ladies and gentlemen, it's now a lot later in the afternoon. It's been a busy one. The game's still going. Uh, I've done quite a few more Reggie Gigas raids, but no more shinies. Nothing remotely useful or good at all, either. I don't honestly know how much of this Summer Solstice event I'm going to play, I have to say, just because it, it looks pretty poor. One thing to note is that the end of the month, the end of June, is going to bring in the Bidoof event. Shiny Bidoof is going to be released, which I am extremely happy to see. The ultimate meme of Pokemon. I'm hoping that the spawns will be absolutely everywhere. I'm hoping the carpet bomb the map with Bidoof. 25th of June 
is when that Badoof event will start. I'm going to say thank you very much for watching, everybody. Please do make sure to subscribe if you are new with the notifications on so you don't miss any uploads or live streams. And of course, smash that like button if you enjoyed the video. Oh, yeah, so I've got a raid invite. Perfect. I'll do that raid invite then. Best of luck, everybody, for the shiny Reggie Gigas grind. Hope that you can get that shiny. Best of luck for the Hundo as well because it does max out some incredible CP. It's not overly useful. It's very, very tanky, but that's about all it's useful for. It is here until the 1st of July, so you've got a good chunk of time to go shiny hunting for it. And with that, I will see you all in the next video, ladies and gentlemen. Do take care. <laughs>